Hey there, Gemini. How are you guys? I hope all of you are doing well. We're going to jump right into a reading today. We're going to start with the Energy Oracles, and then we're going to switch over to the Chakra Wisdom Tarot. See what's going on for Gemini. Please and thank you, Spirit. What have we got going on for Gemini? your mind is very clear, Gemini. Um, I feel like you're not being calculated at this time, but at the same time, you are being calculated. You are well aware that there are multiple ways you can get to where it is you're trying to go. There's a couple ways you can go about this, and you are very clear on both ways like the obstacles that might come up or the detours or you know what I mean who might be involved and what sacrifices you might need to make I don't know why I'm hearing but dress for the weather some of you are maybe traveling Dressing for the weather. Hmm. First chakra, Archangel Michael. I feel like he's clearing away for you here. Root chakra. Some of you might be having a root chakra, what is that called? A kundalini. Kundalini awakening, or just activity in general. It might not be the first time, but there's definitely some root chakra energy. Okay, so side note, if you guys are not sexually active, um, but you like sway from leg to leg when you're standing you like you want to move that energy right you don't have to be sexually active to do that you can just kind of move or do you even dance if you guys like dancing to music but moving your hips will really help especially if you're having like um pains or anything now i'm not a doctor of course go ahead and see your physician or whatever but um That can definitely help if you feel like you have a buildup in that chakra. Certain crystals you can place on those areas. There's even um, meditations you can listen to that are free here on YouTube. I feel like you want to get to the root of something. Or exposing a truth. The divine is helping you do this. Interesting because your shadow will essentially go into the dark places and seek a truth. Some of you don't have to go to a dark place to seek a truth. Some of you are actually going to your Akashic Records here to seek a truth. Because you're being guided to. For others of you, your shadow has earned its wings. And is bringing a truth to you. It could be something that's deep-rooted, deep in your past, childhood, past lives. But you are transforming the energy with the butterfly. You guys see the butterfly here? You're transforming the energy.
the fool taking a leap of faith here. The Fool is a brand new, clean slate, fresh start. You guys are clearing the way. Clearing the past. Or clearly understanding more of the future. Making it more possible to obtain it. Side note, this dress is gorgeous. I'm just saying. <laughs> um, let's see what else for Gemini. The Hermit. Wow, Major Arcanas, Guardian Angels, Akashic Records. You guys are um, very ascended, very experienced. I feel like you probably don't even need the tarot anymore, but it is fun to come and you know, see what's going on every now and then. Interesting how the chakras are even aligning. The hermit, see going within to seek the answer. And there is your answer. Some of you are going to a dark place to get answers. Some of you are going to the light place, higher realms to get the answers. Some of you are going both because you're experienced. Some of you guys are remembering your first dark night of the soul. There's something, there's something at that seed point. That is the seed point, your first dark night. When you were alone and no one was there and you had to like get through it yourself and you did, you came out the other side very different. I feel like you learned something through that experience that you're simply going to be reminded of. And it's like, oh, that's right. Because you're very wise. You've got a lot of information just rattling around. There's something that's going to come back to the surface is what I feel. Okay. So Chakra Archangel Michael, please, for Gemini. You've been working on clearing the path. See, and you've done it so many times before. That's why... But the fool, that was the very first time. The very first time. There's something that you're going to bring back from that that you can use to continue your work. And now you're doing it with a clean slate. Some of you guys are going to remember that you've already cleared something out of your way. You've already cleared that karma is what I want to say. Or you're remembering how to clear your karma of something. Something else happened, but you've gone through this before. You might only be going through it again to remember I feel like there, you're not even going to really have to clean up afterwards. You know, the energetic reset. You take your, your spirit bath and then you want to sage again afterwards. Even though you did it before, you still want to do it afterwards too to clear whatever you released. It's going to be something simple like that. Make sure you're drinking water. Lots of water at this time. Yep, the sun card. Yay! Oh, yeah. Major success. Major victory. You might not be able to see it right now, but I hope this message helps you with that. We've got Pisces, Neptune, Virgo, Libra, Virgo, and Leo. Oh, and Aquarius. Archangels. Three major arcana, that's a lot, you guys. 
Some of you guys feel like you can't see your way forward until you address this. I think you're I think you're right. Because it'll just come back up again later, even if you are able to kind of move past it. But nah, you've worked too hard. We're not gonna we're not gonna do that. We're gonna deal with this and then keep moving forward. It's not as big and scary as you might be thinking, so I just hope if anything this helps to calm your nerves. Especially with the sun card there, the warmth. Look at how big. I just want to point out, you see this truth that you're bringing to the surface? Look how big it gets. It's interesting how it starts here, and then it's almost like the sky is calling it, and then it ends up here, and it's just rising, and then it's here where it's almost midday. Anyways, guys, I'm going to go ahead and leave this here. I hope this message helps who it needs to, how it needs to. I love you guys, and I will see you very soon. Until then, please remember to like, share, subscribe, and mwah, stay beautiful. Namaste.